Okay, we're here in Chatham County. Uh, this is Mitch Woodward with North Carolina Cooperative Extension. And today we're looking at this urban stream. And here we have Greg Jennings, NC State University. Greg, uh, on this urban stream, what's wrong with these stream banks we're looking at here? Well, Mitch, this is a typical urban stream. We have a backyard here where we have quite a bit of urban stormwater runoff that over time has caused erosion in the stream bank. And you see I'm standing in what most people would call a ditch. It's about three feet deep. The stream banks themselves are eroding. We have no native plants helping to anchor the stream banks in place. And generally we have a very poor quality habitat for this backyard. Is this typical of a lot of urban streams that you see and, and what causes this bank erosion? It is typical, Mitch. We see that the increased stormwater runoff that occurs when we have development leads to more energy in the system, more erosion. And then compounding that is the fact that lots of homeowners remove the native plants that help to hold these streams together and replace that with turf grass. And this project today that we'll be working on, we're actually going to regrade the stream banks back to a stable slope, and we're gonna replant native tr trees and shrubs that will help anchor that soil in place. I'm uh, focusing now on downstream from where Greg is, and you can see as it winds through this neighborhood, and we're going to re-sculpt these banks, and next we're gonna take a look at the plants along the banks and what we keep and what we remove. 